<clears throat> All right. It was a relief to leave the crime. Blah, 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 blah. I could talk. Fault. You were just at the crime scene. <laughs> <laughs> you were emotionally distraught. <laughs> All right. They didn't even see the body this time. It's so. true. It was some unnamed maintenance worker they didn't feel like actually giving a uh, art, fixer to. art to. Yeah, giving an art. Yes. It was a relief <laughs> to leave the crime scene, considering all that had happened. When I reached into my pocket to take a look at the list, however, I found something unexpected. It was a small piece of paper with the word Tatsu written on it. How did it get there? Tatsu? Did that sound like... Did, did that guy probably. Well, yeah. yeah. My earlier encounter with the masked person was the only time today someone was close enough to smuggle something into my pocket. I figured if someone like Bryce tried to do something like that, I definitely would have noticed. You are making assumptions. I, just because he's a dragon. Doesn't mean he can't be stealthy. Yeah. Doesn't mean he necessarily can't pick pockets or reverse pick pockets. Mm-hmm. As for Tatsu, the only related thing I could think of was Tatsu Park, which I had come across when I went to the police station the other day. Mm-hmm. And if that park was the place the mysterious pair referred to, I didn't know if it was actually a good idea to visit. The masked person may have saved me from the falling light fixture, but if it was Reza, it would mean following someone who was also the prime suspect of two murders. I also had to consider the list of places Reza had been to. A local grocery store, the production facility we had visited, and the library were the three places closest to here. It certainly was going to be a busy day, and I knew I wouldn't have the time to visit all of them. <coughs> oh boy. Grocery store, we haven't actually really been there. Why the grocery store? Because we've never been there. But why does that mean it matters? The new characters, my bro. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? It's a dating sim. Uh, How are you not focused on this? I mean, I'm pretty sure the five characters we have that with are, are are the main the main yeah yeah people. I, and I don't I think we're be. likely to find. I don't think we're likely to find any other any other dateable characters. <laughs> we might find more supporting characters. We might. Yes. Uh, I, I'd say grocery store or tattoo park. Yeah, I, think that I mean, it's likely we we're should. only going to get a chance to visit two. Yeah, we should. I think we should visit Topsy Park today. Let's do it first. Yeah, let's do it first. All right. Tatsu Park. Here I am. I don't know what I'm even looking for, though. Uh, let's read the sign. This park is dedicated to our creator, to whom we owe our sentience and existence. As it is our duty to remember, this place honors them every day with its beauty and grants a place of recreation and contemplation to all of us. Huh. Is a real person or a god figure? Is Who knows? that person remember? Which person? Remember when you were doing the card game? No, that, that, that was, was a historian. historian. Documented oh. that. He's not the creator. Gotcha. Uh, also, we didn't remember his name. We didn't know his name anyway, so it's not like... Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, let's look at the map. Yeah. This park is bigger than I thought. I could go north towards Tatsu Avenue, which apparently is a nice spot to look at the landscape, or south to the political district. Where should I go? Uh, let's stay here for there yeah. now. Let's search the shrubbery. Yeah, this totally won't look strange or suspicious. Here we go. Hey, you already look strange and suspicious because you're a human. That's true. I found some dirt. There doesn't seem to be anything else here. I've got a jar of dirt. Hey, we found a good we got an achievement. <laughs> what? We found a head full of dirt. You're not a very good archaeologist. I'm a terrible archaeologist. Uh, you never know what you'll find around a pavilion. Let's do this. There doesn't seem to be anything important here, but at least it provides excellent shade. We found shade. All right. Let's back. go to the map. Let's go south first. All right. Just as I entered the southern part of the park, I found myself tumbling to the ground when someone suddenly bumped into me. Oh, is it? Is it? Is it? Pink dragon? Is it pink dragon again? Oh, ooh! Oh, oh he's, yeah. arm. he's kind of cool looking. Yeah. Who's running? Who's reading for Lucius? Uh, let's, I think it's me. All right. All right. Uh, I don't know if I've actually got three distinct voices in me <laughs> that I can remember between uh, times that Lucius shows up. It's all right. He will probably he'll probably never show up again. Because maybe probably. we don't know. Sorry about that. Are you alright? Besides being a little dirtier than before, I think so. I should really look where I'm going. Sometimes I just get lost in my thoughts. Hey, I think you dropped this. Oh, thank you. Ghost stories, huh? Yep. 
Oh, I should probably go before the bookstore closes. Bye. Bye. <laughs> See ya. <laughs> There's someone sitting on the benches. I mean, clearly we're going to approach the dragon. <laughs> yeah. Oh, well, it's a... I need your mom. <laughs> <laughs> Hashtag mom dragon. Yeah. <laughs> What? A most pleasant surprise meeting you here, Zonny. <laughs> wow. Do you know who I am? Why would I know who you are? I'm afraid I don't. Why do you know who I am? Then let me fill that gap in your knowledge. My name is Amara, and I am the Minister of Culture and Arts. I see. And what brings you here today, Zonny? I'm not quite sure of that myself. Ah, the park does have an appeal that naturally draws people in. I would know, since the, I'm partly responsible for creating it. Have you seen the north side yet? If not, you totally should. It's just so pretty this time of year. You created this park? Well, some of it. Do you see the building behind me? That's where I work. Do you want to know a secret? The park was built here so I could enjoy going outside on my breaks, like right now, for example. Can I ask you a question? You can ask, for sure, but whether I can answer or not is another question. What would you like to know? Uh... Ask for the park? Mm -hmm. Sure. Can you tell me more about Tatsu Park? Well, I'm not so sure there's much to say about it. It just opened recently. I think the initial request was for more open spaces, like a dedicated place for people to gather and such. If you read the plaque, you would know that the park was dedicated to our so-called creator. I say creator like that because I think the word is a bit of a misnomer, but I suppose people still use it regardless. Can you tell me more about your job? I could, but I think overall it's a very boring affair. It involves a lot of reading and talking, and approving or rejecting forms and projects. It has its perks, but in some way I'll certainly be happy when my term is over. If you've been minister once, that's something people will remember you for, even if those times are long past. No one can ever take that away from you again. You mentioned your term ending. How does that work here? We, the ministers, serve our term, and then someone else takes our place. Only one minister changes at a time, though. Technically speaking, any person can become a minister, though there are certain standards and requirements that must be met in order to apply for office. I don't want to bore you with the details, as that too would be a long and tedious affair. What do you think about us visiting this world? <laughs> you and Reza? Well, I think it's about the most exciting thing that has happened here in the last few years. It certainly has been a nice distraction from the other boring things I have to do at work. How so? Hmm. Arranging your arrival is partly my responsibility. In fact, I would have been at the portal to welcome you myself if something didn't come up at the last second. <clears throat> That's all. Bye. I suppose I should be getting back to work anyway. Well, thank you for this most pleasant conversation, Zonny. You know, if you wanted to continue talking at a later time, you should have no difficulty contacting me. I'll keep that in mind. Back we go. <coughs> let's and go north. Let's go north. <laughs> um, we'll open the hatch last. Yeah, that's <laughs> like plan. I don't recognize this species of tree. You still don't recognize it. Good Weird. to know. Bad biologist, bad. <laughs> right, it's an alien tree. Yes. And also, don't biologists usually deal with animals, not plants? You know, both. Well, that or, depends. Or, like, like they specialize, don't they? I mean, biologists technically don't focus on animals or plants. They tend to focus on biological material and research into biological things. So they focus a lot on test uh, species. Oh, hey. <laughs> Finally, a place to sit down. The view of the scenery is perfect. Hey, another achievement. Landscaper. <laughs> <Yay. laughs> that was nice. I was just about to get up when I noticed someone sitting next to me. Ah. That's a girl. 
Are you sure? I think so. She's wearing a heart. That doesn't necessarily mean it's a girl. True. Whoa, I didn't see you there. I thought you were a statue or something. Tremavian. Ah, uh, fire name. <laughs> All right, who's reading for Tremavian? Well, there's no words. Well, mm. true. Hang on. Hello? Well, maybe it is a statue, or I just turned invisible. I hope it's not the latter. <laughs> well, I'll bye, I guess. No one needs to read for Dramavian. Yeah. <laughs> we still don't recognize the Lee's Blast Talk. All right. On the metal covering of the hatch, there are two buttons that are situated to the left and right of a central circular lever. There are on the lever is pointing up. Uh, press the first button. Okay, the first button is now pressed and it's flush with the metal covering of the hatch. Second button. Now the second button is pressed. Turn the lever clockwise. It's now pointing right. It's now pointing down. Left. Did we do it? Yes. We did. Go us. I don't know what we did, but we solved it. Good we job. We're the best off. at puzzles. Right. <laughs> I looked down to see the maintenance tunnels for the underground drain system. A pale object starkly contrasted against the pitch black backdrop. Calmly goes down. Yeah. It's a cloth with suspicious red markings all over it. I acquired a bloody bandage, another achievement. I guess that's all to be found down here. A bloody bandage means something like Mavers would wear. What? <laughs> well, I don't like him. <laughs> but uh, wasn't Razor injured too? Maybe it was Where's his bandage. Bench again? Uh, no, the, the, the Razor wasn't injured, I don't think. No, Mavers, I said. Oh, yeah, Razor. I said Razor. Oh, okay. I'm already well rested. I shouldn't waste any more time. Well, fine then. I guess we're done here. Stop. Sitting. We've done everything. I don't think I'll find anything else here. Well, fine. All right, I got some more time left. What should I do? What's next? Library. Uh, well, you can find out our grocery store. I, I don't know. What do you? Uh-huh. <laughs> if you go to the library, you might be able to find out who the creator is. All right. What was in the library? Library. Library. Delivery. All right, Reza, what did you want here? Hey, it's Remy. I already told you. All right, I always forget my right voice, so it doesn't matter. <laughs> <laughs> now that's the right voice, and now it's going to change every time. That, so the Remy voice is kind of deeper and very flat and, and, and <laughs> sounds socially insecure. <laughs> <laughs> I already told you, it's not here. Who's he talking to? Nadine? Won't you help out an old friend? Friend? This is the first time you've spoken to me in years. And whose fault is that? For you, I didn't even exist these last few years. At least I tried to reach out to you. No, you're just here because you want something. I'm right here, right now, and you still continue to act like that. She was my friend too, you know. I think you should leave. For what it's worth, I'm sorry. For everything. It's a little late for apologies. Have it your way, then. Adeen stormed out so quickly that she didn't even notice me. I waited a few moments and wondered if it was a good time to talk to Remy. In the end, I decided that my task was too pressing to come back another time. I shoveled through books and tried to look busy until I noticed he resumed his work so I could approach him. Hello, Zani. How can I help you? Oh. How are you doing? I'm doing fine, thank you. Wait, you were here that whole time? 
Not the whole time, just long enough to know that something's up. It's nothing that concerns you. Come on, it does concern me. I know you, and I know Adine. It's really nothing of great importance. Are you aware of a certain prehistoric underground building we recently discovered? I've heard of it. She wanted a blueprint of it, which was one of the things I found inside the building during an investigation. Why would you have it? We're not just a library, you know, but a whole archive that stores all sorts of information and objects. In any case, a blueprint is the kind of thing that we place in our care eventually. So she thinks you have it? Even if we did, it wouldn't be something that we could just give out to anyone. Of course. Reza? He's visited quite often since he arrived, actually. Until a few days ago, that is. Do you know what he was reading? Not particularly. I thought he just wanted to learn about our world. Did you notice anything unusual about him while he was here? Can't say I did, though he did ask me for a map once. A map? Yes. I showed him a few, but none of them seemed to be what he was looking for. <clears throat> did he talk to you about anything strange while he was here? Besides the maps, nothing else worth mentioning comes to mind. Only the usual pleasantries. That's all. Thanks for your help. You're welcome. The afternoon sun sun hung low in the sky. I decided it was time to report my findings to the police. A brief call to the department, and I was on my way to an appointment with Sebastian. I'm not sure how my findings will help, but at least I have something. What could we have here? Oh. Oh. Let's try again. Scroll back. (laughs) What could we have here? I turned around to see Maverick. His intense gaze confirmed that there was no one else his words could have been directed at. Even with the civilians passing by in the background, I suddenly felt very alone. What do you want from me? Answers. Uh, this one, I think. Mm -hmm. Just tell me one thing. Why? What is your goal in all of this? Why even come here? Uh, this one. Yeah, that one. No, no, no. That won't do. That's simply not true. You know it, and I know it. I just don't get why you can't be honest with me, even when you know no one else is listening. Why would I be... If there was something more to it, why the fuck would I tell you? Because of the uh, great reform we formed. <laughs> <laughs> You know I can't touch you. If I did, it would be over for me. At least as long as I don't have any proof. In the end, what difference does it make if I know? No one is going to believe me anyway. Do you wish to kill me, too? Like Reza? I know. Is that so? Tell me, why would an ambassador need such a dangerous tool in the first place? I know you claim not to have one of those things Reza injured me with, and you didn't have any when they searched you, but I guess it's way too late for safety precautions at this point. You could have hidden one anywhere. That damn hurt, you know. But even worse than that was getting thrown aside by Bryce. I trust him, but after what happened... He doesn't trust me anymore. <clears throat> now, there's only you. The mythical, the special, the new. How much I wish I could make him see what I see. I could have saved the world with what I did that day, and it still wouldn't matter when no one believes me. Just because I don't have any proof. Well, yeah, that works. But I won't stop until I find some. And when I do... I'm going to be a damn hero. You, uh... And then, I, and you, then uh, I'm going to kill you. You, uh, then. you have fun with that. It's, let me know how it goes. Hey, uh, fuck. Hey, fuck. <laughs> no. No. <laughs> absolutely not. That sounds awful. <laughs> and with that, he was gone. On the way to the police station, 
Maverick's words kept finding their way back into my mind. I couldn't decide how to feel about them. I wasn't even sure if it was worth mentioning to the police, since all he did was make vague accusations. It wasn't anything substantial enough to be considered a threat. However, his actions were growing more calculated, and he seemed very sure of himself. I wondered about what this could amount to. But that wasn't the problem at hand. Yeah. You seem to be heading towards the point where Hello? it won't be safe for you to travel around on hey, your own. Hey, Zonny! Hey, Sebastian. I thought I'd meet you at the front desk. What are we doing in Bryce's op- office? He does have a nice office, doesn't he? And the chairs are comfy. <laughs> Is that the only reason we're in here? The dragon gave a brief chuckle. <laughs> Let's just say that any information pertaining to this case is important enough to warrant some privacy. I see. Will Bryce be here anytime soon? I don't think so. He's still outside looking for Reza. He's not the kind of person who gives up easily. Yeah, it sounds like him. Yeah. <laughs> That's Bryce for you. Once he sets his mind on something, he sees it through the end. That's why he's our chief. He has things done. <clears throat> At this rate, it doesn't look like we'll find him today. Could be anywhere. Long gone. Beyond our reach. What do you think? I don't think he's going anywhere. I don't think he's likely. He just ran off and tied to hide in the forest. Mm-hmm. I don't think he's going anywhere. He can't flee to another place. No matter where he goes, he'd be recognized immediately. In the end, his only way out is the same way he got in. The portal. He can't use that without someone noticing. Very astute observation. I wonder what will happen to our trade agreement now, considering Reza is still missing, the murderers, and the stolen generator. If Reza really is the murderer, then... Don't do that. What? Worry. You don't know what's at stake here. People are dead, Zani. Don't you think I know that? Reza may be our prime suspect, but he's also a missing person. For all we know, he could be a victim. Maybe someone is making him do this. <laughs> My point is, we don't know the facts yet. What we need to do is find him, and find the murderer. We'll find Reza, and go from there. We'll figure it out. Together. <laughs> forever. No. As friends. No. Stop. <laughs> I mean, he is, he, I, he is a romance option. Yes. Oh, God. Thanks, Sebastian. Anyway, I thought Sebastian said, yeah. wasn't a romance option. Uh, uh, no, no, he's... Oh, he isn't. He's not a romance option. No, oh, it's other, 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 other Tim voices. Just right. the captain. Just the captain, for some reason. Uh, anyway, you said you had some information for us. So what'd you find? The bandage you found is something, all right. Of course, it could be anybody's, but why would someone discard theirs in a place like this? It seems suspicious to me, and it's certainly worth checking out. I'll make sure it gets to the right place. The map in the library? I don't know what to think about that. He could have needed a map to plan something, I suppose, but who knows what he really wanted to do with it. It's the kind of detail that, on its own, might not tell us much, but could be crucial <coughs> Well done, Zani. This gives us some solid points from which we can continue our investigation. Yay! I did well. Second tier cadet badge. Yay. In any case, thanks for your help. We really do appreciate it. You're welcome. That should be all, then. Since Bryce still hasn't come back, I assume the search is still going on. I better get out there and help. Guess it's going to be a long day. Can you find your way back to your apartment? No, I'm totally lost. Of course. All right. I will see you later. Good luck. You really need to get one of those badge stickers. <laughs> Temporary investigator. Mm-hmm. Finally, some free time. Whatever am I going to do? 